Hello guys and welcome to a brand new series called Most Searched Questions about Premiere Pro for Beginners. We're gonna take a look at this huge Google search page right here and apparently we're gonna talk about the types of cuts in Premiere Pro. So let's get into it. The first one will be of course a normal cut. To add a cut to this clip, go to the toolbar and find the razor tool. Then in the timeline, you can add a cut by simply clicking your video. We're gonna remove this little pause in my sentence here. Now simply trim the clip shorter and drag them against each other. Now you have a jump cut. This AI tool has been released, the world kinda changed. This AI tool has been released, the world kinda changed. This doesn't really look so good, so to fix that, we're gonna scale up the second clip. Make sure it's selected and go to the effect controls. Then in here, simply increase the scale and adjust the position so that it fits in your frame. Generator fill is extremely powerful. Ever since this AI tool has been released, the world kinda changed. And there you go. The next cut is a J cut. Now a J cut is kinda something like this. Here you can see a clip of me speaking and on the right, it cuts to a B-roll clip of mountains. Today was a beautiful day guys. I went hiking on these beautiful mountains here. Now, if we want to make this a J cut instead of a regular cut, simply trim the second clip a little bit to the right. Then go to the first clip and grab the end of it. Now make this clip a little longer. That way the sound of the second clip will already be hearable when you're still seeing the first clip. Today was a beautiful day, guys. I went hiking on these beautiful mountains here. It's also literally the shape of a J. Now, the next cut is actually gonna be an L cut. This is basically the same as a J cut, but the other way around. This time, go to the first clip and trim it a little shorter. Then grab the second clip and trim that one a little longer. That way you can already see the second clip but you're still hearing the first one. Today was a beautiful day guys. I went hiking on these beautiful mountains here. It is that simple. Next I want to show you an invisible cut which is amazing. But first I'm gonna tell you about my Adobe Premiere Pro beginners course where you can become a professional editor in just three hours. From learning the absolute editing fundamentals to creating amazing animations, graphic layers, text, color grading, music and sound effects basically everything there is to learn about Premiere Pro. So if you want to level up and become a professional video editor, click the link down below. And now, the invisible cut. This is when you cut right in the action of a movement in a video. For example, this laptop. Here you can see two clips of me opening up my MacBook. The first one is more of a medium shot and the second one is a close-up. Now, to make both of these shots flow into each other, move the player to the first clip and find the movement where I'm opening the MacBook. Then trim away everything on the right side. Now, go to the second clip and find the moment where again I'm opening up the laptop. This time trim away everything on the left side. All that's left to do now is to snap both of the clips against each other and there you go. Now there are a lot more types of cuts you can learn so definitely check out the course in the description. Next I want to show you 20 secret features that every Premiere user needs to know right here in the video on my left. Thank you guys so much for watching and as always stay creative.